reason that 9200 is a good fit to get this many towers done is quite simple. T&D coatings in general, especially aged lattice towers, is a very unique coating situation. Blasting is impossible logistically, cost-wise, safety-wise, environmental-wise. It's just not even, not even in the picture. So that limits you automatically to what you can do uh, in terms of surface preparation and cleaning. It turns out that inventing a coating like Induron 9200 that can be put over tight rust is, is critical. Otherwise, you'd go from $20,000 a tower to $150,000, $200,000 per tower, multiply that by $40,000, and you've got an unworkable situation. The surface tolerance uh, includes the wetting ability, which is the linseed oil. I've heard many speakers at conferences say linseed oil is the best wetting substance on the planet for rusty metal. And I believe that's true, otherwise it wouldn't still be sole sourced by practically every utility in the country. The second thing is the low stress on it, age coatings that may be on the sur surface. A lot of the modern high-tech coatings have stre curing stressors that would pull at those old coatings and delaminate them. Uh, environmentally, uh, it's, it's perfect. It's, it's almost no solvent, very low solvent. Easy to mix, easy to apply, up in the air. If you're up in the air and you got a problem applying a coating, you got to come down and rework it and it's uh, time consuming and you know these guys are paid on how much they produce so they want an effective easy to use coating which is what 9200 is.